Good morning. It's 9.43 p.m. No, I've not been asleep all day. I woke up super early. I had to take my son to uh, the doctor for a couple tests. Oh, my light's flashing. Oh, no. I think it's dying. I hope everybody had a great week. My vacation has come to an end. Today is Thursday. It's Vlogtober 5, 10, 15, deuce. And uh, I work tomorrow and I work Saturday. I got my beautiful hat that my buddy Susie Cusy made me for my birthday. I have 11 balls of Woolies Thick and Quick. Because <coughs> I'm making a project. No, I did not buy this yarn. My wonderful son made it. Here's a sneak peek. That's all I'll show you. I'll show you when it's finished. Uh, he took me to Walmart yesterday. And he said, Do they sell yarn here? And I said, Of course. He's like, Okay, old lady. Go crazy. And, uh, first thing, I was like, What's my limit? You know, he's he's my youngest boy. He's 19. And I was like, is it twenty dollars? He's like up thirty, up forty. He's all up, all fifty. He's all don't worry, I got you. <laughs> ho ho ho. So I think I spent sixty five dollars. <laughs> Shit, I didn't pay for it. Who cares? <laughs> uh, Misty Rain. I'm glad you got your package and you like the colors. Carol, yay! Happy birthday to us, baby. I'm glad you liked your colors, too. I took a chance on what to get. Girl, I did not know you had that wall of yarn behind you, that beautiful wall of yarn. It's so gorgeous. I have a big wall here, and I like to uh, put yarn cages. <coughs> Sorry. I'd like to put some yarn cages, but my boys said that they're not going to allow me to do that. So, until then, I'll have storage boxes all in the living room, my room, and the boys' bedroom. They don't let me put it in one place. It's going to be all over the place, right? Uh, I was feeling kind of down today. I was thinking about my birthday and the age I am and where I am in life and wasn't too excited with how everything has turned out. I was feeling kind of down. So I took a nap and that's when I was messaging uh, Misty Rain. Trowel. Hey Trowel. And I ended up taking like a three hour nap. So I think I'm going to pay for it because I have work tomorrow. And funny thing is this morning when I woke up I had to be up at 6 to take my son to the doctor at 7. My foot was hurting. I mean it hasn't hurt all week. I've told you guys I'm feeling great. I feel fantastic. And I woke up this morning and it was hurting and I said no 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 footsie no we're not going to work today. We're going to take the boy to the doctor. And foot pain went away. I was like, what? Say what? So I guess it is all in my mind. I don't know. But I did buy, uh, where, where they injected me with the cortisone shot. I have like a nice, it looks like a little baby tumor on the side of my foot. And I meant to go to the doctor yesterday and I ran around so much. I didn't even make the appointment. But I've been rubbing it out, whatever it is. It could be just some medicine stuck there. I don't know. I'm not worried. On the side of my foot, where the little toe is, like on the side right here, I think I have a bunion or whatever it's called from walking funny, from having the heel spur. So I bought some little Sharon Bucci. Hey, Sharon! I talked to her and she told me to buy some little, they're like little pillows, donut pillows. <coughs> Sorry. So I bought those, got those at Walmart for 90 cents. I'll try those out tomorrow at work. <sighs> As for um, my birthday, 
overall it was okay. It was quite hectic, you know. Like I said, Step Monster made it, was trying to make it really bad. And she succeeded to some point, but I would try and stop her and try and continue to be happy because like I've told you guys many many times I fight to be happy I fight for my happiness you know it's a very negative situation here and uh, I make the best of it and that's why I have found the love of crochet to help me pass the time and make things better we just got home from ordering pizza. Here's my little baby, Jeffrey. We went to go get some pizza and I'll, um, I don't think I'll enclose a picture. I'm gonna, he says hi. <laughs> I'm gonna get some hot tea later and I'm gonna try and finish this project tonight because I'm sure I'll be up for about two hours. Uh, oh, okay, so Carol got her package. Uh, Misty Rain got his package, and there's one more package that was sent out. It's a secret surprise, and a darn post office. I sent it locally. I'm not going to say where, but I sent it locally. Oh, and uh, Fury's Angels Crochet. Your package went out today as well. You're close to me, girl. You're very close to me. Anyways, um... The one package that I sent locally, which I could have driven, but I want it to be a surprise. Freaking post office sent it to Virginia. I tracked it, and I'm like, why the fuck is it in Virginia? It's supposed to go right here. Sorry, we'll ship it back to you. I hope it's not damaged. There's nothing expensive or... Uh, well, it is valuable because it's yarn, but <laughs> it's not like uh, I can't replace it. You know what I'm saying? Ugh. And I sent it priority, so it's supposed to be there today. Guaranteed today. And it's in Virginia somewhere, which is really upsetting me. So I hope that package arrives to its new owner safely. <clears throat> and I hope everybody has a great Thursday night. Tomorrow, I believe, is a full moon, and I'm excited. Hooray! I used to be excited for full moons. Not so much anymore. I'm celebrating my one year of celibacy. Dum dum dum. I don't know. Alright, people. I'm gonna crochet. I hope you guys have a great Thursday. 5, 10, 15, deuce. Blocktober. Peace out. Bye.